Welcome to Cooking with Steve. Today we'll be making a cucumber salsa. Here is an easy and unique salsa that I made recently. A combination of cucumber and Granny Smith apples is not a combination that I think of when I think of a salsa. But this salsa was delicious. It is not too hot, but you can increase the spiciness of the salsa by adding a little bit more chopped jalapenos. I serve this with tortilla chips. Enjoy and let's get cooking. We're going to need the following ingredients for today's recipe. We're going to need two teaspoons of sugar and one teaspoon of kosher salt. We are going to need six tablespoons of lime juice. We're going to need two cucumbers. We're going to need two Granny Smith apples. We're going to need two jalapeno peppers. We're going to need about one cup of cilantro chopped and we're going to need one red onion. First thing we need to do is to dice up our onion and we do so by cutting off both ends, cutting it in half, peeling the outer layer and then chopping it up into a nice dice. Add your diced onions to a large mixing bowl and then chop up your jalapenos by cutting off the end slicing them in half, slicing each half in half again, and then cutting it up into a nice uh, dice. Um, if you want to make your uh, salsa a little less spicy, uh, you want to remove the seeds and stems, but if you're like me and like it a little spicy, keep them in. Uh, one thing, make sure that after you're done that you wash your hands thoroughly, because if you touch your eyes after you've been handling jalapenos, you will regret it. Once chopped up, add your jalapenos to your onions in your mixing bowl. Next, add your one cup of chopped cilantro to your mixing bowl. Now add one teaspoon of kosher salt and add two teaspoons of sugar. Now add six tablespoons of lime juice. Now mix up your salsa well with a good stir. Peel your cucumbers and then cut off both ends and then cut them in half and then cut them in half again and then slice them up creating a nice even dice of your cucumbers. Once done, add them to your salsa. Stir your uh, cucumber into your salsa well. Next take your two peeled uh, Granny Smith apples and cut them into quarters 
and then cut off the core from each uh, uh, apple quarter by going diagonally like so and then cut them up into a small dice. Your chopped apples to your salsa. Give your salsa a good stir, incorporating all the ingredients fully, and our salsa is now done. So all remains is for us now to give it a taste. To present my salsa, I'm going to transfer it to a larger bowl. So let's get out some tortilla chips and see how our salsa tastes. Delicious!